In this video, we are going to verify that the directories uh, and license of on-screen takeoff are properly set up. So we're going to go first to www.eic.fiu.edu to start on the um, EIC um, portal. And from that point, we want to go to access EIC uh, apps. I have already installed the application, so I'm just going to skip to the logon, enter my username and password. And then uh, this will give me access to all the uh, software that they have on the engineering center. I'm going to go ahead and uh, start on on-screen takeoff. This uh, creates a uh, launch icon on the bottom. Uh, make sure that you do not have a um, pop-up uh, window blocker because then it will not start. Sometimes you do have to click on that icon and open it. Uh, depending on the browser, it may start automatically. You may also have a different setup where it will ask for permissions to run the software in your machine. If that's the case, then yes, uh, give the computer permission to run the software. So then uh, on-screen takeoff is going to start. And uh, what we want to do is we want to check that the uh, directories uh, that the software has are the same as the ones that we've created before. So we go Tools, Options, Folders, and we see that these uh, directories all are starting with the letter C. So we want to delete that C and uh, place an H instead. Okay, so basically I go one by one, delete the letter C at the beginning of the path, and replace that with the letter H. That means that all the directories are going to be looking at the H drive and in the folders that we have created previously. We click Apply and OK. And just uh, for good measure, we'll go back tools, options, and check the folders again to make sure that they are uh, actually the ones that we're expecting. This has to be done every time that you open on-screen takeoff. Every single time you have to check the folders and make sure that they are correct. In my case, uh, the software has been authorized. If you see the bottom right corner of the screen, it says TKO. If your software is not activated, you need to activate the license. So you go into File, Check Authorization, then select what it says Float um, License, and then the license server is called License 6, L-I-C-E-N-S-E -E, number 6, without um, spaces then click the activate and that should turn the um, the no uh, authorization or software not authorized into TKO. That is the verification that we need to do every time that we use on-screen take. 